What is up YouTube and today I'm back with part two of Red Dead Redemption. Howdy, mister. All genuine stuff here. Bruh. Sure we literally have my guy, John Marston. Literally has zero dollars in his pocket. My guy. I was talking to some Blackwater My guy is broke. Literally. This game is just how it, just how I remember it being. The aesthetic, the map, the music. Armadillo. It's actually kind of weird. Hold up, hold up, hold up, stop, 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 man. What's wrong with you? Oh, fuck, it's too late to help him, damn. I can't use these guys, man. Oh, Let's get in the coyote. One thing from this game I remember you can kill a horse, like actually kill it, and then you can actually skin the horse and eat it. Yep, yeah, we used to still skin the horse. <laughs> Something we couldn't do in Red Dead Redemption 2, but... Horse meat, damn. Get some money. Let's get some. Okay, I'm always in the market for interesting goods. Anything else I can do for you? We now got seven dollars. That's great. Full course available to play a number of locations. I'm gonna play Five Finger for it. See if you can make some money here. Get my boy John Marston some cash. You know, my, my guy is broke. He needs some money, you know? So, why not? Fuck, god damn it, man. Alright, alright, let's calm down here. I win. I got some. That's the best you got. Yeah, that's the best you got, bro. Now have twelve dollars. My guy just made a five dollar profit. Let's bet five dollars. I just, I don't know, is it just me, but I remember this being a lot more difficult when I first played this game back in 2015. 
but I don't know maybe I just thought older you know it makes a lot of difference you know when you're a kid you like you suck at everything but right Let's go. That boy. And there it is, mister. And we won again. Hey, you. See, now we made a ten dollar profit so far. Let's see how much more we can make. I'm bet five bucks again. Oh, we can bet ten dollars? Oh, ten dollars is the minimum bet. Alright, let's go all in. I'm, I'm gonna stick with ten for now. Holy fuck. Oh, god damn it. Whoa! I guess I'm out of practice. Hey! God damn it! Alright, alright, hold on. We got this. We got this. God damn it. Don't tell me we're gonna lose all our money again. I knew I wasn't drunk enough for this. My guy. My guy won ten dollars. Just to lose it again. Come on. Let's go. Political realities in armadillo. John Marston. You wanted to speak to me. I did. <laughs> Apparently so. Why? I guess because we're both in the business of the law. You that fella from the train company? No, I'm from Fort Mercer. Fort Mercer? You them, one of them Williamson boys. Calm down. Go on, shoot him, mister. Shoot him. <laughs> Come on, what? You, you getting cute with me, boy? What's going on here? I got me one of them Williamson boys. I got me one of them idiots who give marshals a bad name. Oh, no. Put your gun down. Yeah, put your gun down, boy. Who do you think you are, man? You must be the man from Blackwater. Yes, sir. Listen, that dog ain't too bright. But he seems loyal. Jonah, get out of here for a minute. Yeah, get out of here, man. Yes, sir, Mr. Johnson, sir. Yeah, that's what I thought. That's what we yeah. thought. Oh, I didn't see enough of your hide around here, friend. <laughs> I think there's some school children down the way you can go on Friday. Oh, hardy fucking har. Dick. <laughs> what are you doing here, Mr. Marston? Apart from frightening my deputies. I'm here to capture or kill Bill Williamson. <laughs> okay. Can you help me? He's outside my jurisdiction. He's in the next county. Of course, Bill Williamson and his boys have tended to keep themselves away from my town. So you're... Happy to have him out there. Oh, I ain't happy, but I also ain't suicidal. My job is to keep this town safe, not clean up all of these three counties. It's hard enough around here. You know, I hear you speak, and suddenly I'm reminded of how some of the people I respected most in my life had a problem with authority. What's wrong with you? Well, I'm sure you and your fine friends have enjoyed spending your time running around pursuing noble causes. My cause is to keep this town from turning into a living hell for the folks who live here. The whole world has problems, mister. And I'm here, doing what I can. Why? What's happening? Right now? I got the railway, the people who pay my salary, trying to get me to turn a blind eye to them burning down settlements up there. 
I got a bunch of cattle rustlers out near Box Canyon need shutting down. Not forgetting the gang that keeps murdering homesteaders out in the back country. And I got a bunch of hoods over in the saloon, drunk, threatening to shoot up the whole town. That's all I got today. But it's early yet. Give me a couple more days. There'll be more. All right, tell you what. Let's go deal with them hoods in the saloon. Then we'll discuss Williamson. Okay, boy. You're a persistent little cuss, ain't you? Only when things matter. Let's head over to the saloon. All right. I remember. I remember Marshall Lee Johnson from last time. He's a pretty good guy. I feel like. Bunch of two bit hoodlums, led by this fella called Walt. Goddamn road agents who prey on the stages coming in and out of town. Drivers and armadillos spend more time with their hands in the air than on the reins these days. And you're happy to let them drink in your saloon? Happy? No. But the way I figure it, better they're carousing in there than out robbing decent folk. That's an interesting approach to law enforcement. It sure is. All right, let's go deal with them. There's the dumb rat bastard now. Let's follow him. See what kind of hole he crawls into. Walton's the top screw. Let's get after him. Damn, he's seen it. Come on, don't lose him. I sure as the hell do want to kill him. Why don't we just beef him now while we got the chance? Because that ain't how the law works. Is that right, Marshal? And alive, he can still talk. Doesn't sound like he's a man to be reasoned with. He ain't. But a few days of my hospitality and he'll be telling me what I need to know. Walton's gang's been growing fast. Outlawing's easy money for easy work. Jola Springs, Gap Tooth Ridge, these boys get around. Walton's a start, but there's plenty more where he came from. He's headed for Pleasant's house. Let's stop so we can get a better look. Slow up. All right, let's stop. I'll follow that motherfucker. Looks like we got company, boys. <laughs> oh, yeah, you sure as hell do. This is where your life shines, boy. Work our way up this Get ready. Marston, I got you covered. Move up to that wagon. Behind the tree, Marston. Smoke him up. Try aiming at somebody, goddammit. Head for the train, boy. I'll cover you. That fool behind the rock is yours, Marston. Got him, got him. Got him, boy. Got him, John. John, get him, get him. Get him. Oh, fuck you. I got you. I'm gonna get you too, man. Don't worry, you just hang tight. You'll die too. Where's my last one? I wonder if we can get him alive. Yeah, fuck you. Not a bad shot, Mr. Marston. Why don't you check in with me next time you're in town? I don't want to be no policeman, Marshal. <laughs> Nor did I, my friend. I can promise you that. I'll see you soon, Mr. Marston. Of course he's a big shot, man. You know who he is? You know who he's been with? He's been when... This guy's robbed banks in a, in a stage, you know? All right, just want to see if I can... I lost 100 minus 100 honor for what? How the fuck did my honor go down? What the fuck did I do, man? All right. Man, I'm gonna kill their hostess, though. So I can sell their hide. Yeah. Tough one, eh? 
So I got the horse rod, which I can sell. I don't know what I can use it for. I'm, I'm actually rather curious. I got one more horse right here. Like, if you guys know, let me know in the comments below what what horse side can be useful in this game. But I don't know. I don't know where as the, as this moment. I'll look into it, or else eventually the game will tell me at some point. We'll figure it out. We're smart. We're not dumb as the here. All right. All right, guys. I'm gonna call the day here. I'm gonna, I'll catch you guys next time. Peace out.